what's up everyone so today i have kind of mixed feelings about this just because of the reviews i've heard from other people on this song but today i'm going to be reacting hopefully in a non-biased way in an unbiased way sorry to um Wuaz. uh yeah it's, a it's it's not a funny name in and of itself i mean it kind of is but when i when i say it i feel like it's funny um Wuaz come back with their song bad girl i've heard interesting things about this um their their debut was a banger they debuted with the wuwa that was their song or technically it's uwa yeah according to the hongwu but i've heard interesting things about this one i think from what i've heard, and i've also heard a tid heard heard tidbits of the song itself and i've seen tidbits of the dance I've just never watched it all the way through or I've never watched more than 30 seconds of it so I wouldn't know how this is gonna go I think this should be interesting I don't remember if I have a bias in this group I'm gonna check um, I don't really keep up with this group so much as I keep up with their music in particular let me check I have my bias list in my notes uh, no I do not I do not have a bias in this group so we shall see we shall see how this ends up i might end up with a bias i might not we shall see so without further ado let's go let's go is that a mouse that's a mouse it's a cat why is it a mouse with a cat sound Ooh. I'm assuming this is like a cat and mouse kind of thing because the, 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 the avatar thing in the background is a mouse but they're cats and there's cats in this video What? This is a banger! What? Okay, I think particular part of the song that was in the teaser is this so enjoyable what come on let's go Ooh, i vibe with that girl's rap more in my opinion both are excellent though What? They can- Okay, no, that was the second rapper, I think. Just with her hair. No, what? There's three rappers? Excuse me? The girl with the hair down, I liked her rap. Melodic, I think it's melodic rap. And the girl with the pigtails, I vibed with her rap the most. Those two. I will discover who they are after this. Ooh. Oh. Part is the bridge because I haven't heard it. I know what this reminds me of. It's this part. It's this part. Wait, I love her rap. I think, who is she? Who is she? I need to find out after this. Ooh, that, oh god, that's kind of hurting my eyes a little bit. Okay, it's kind of hurting my eyes. I'm not even photosensitive. If you're gonna watch the Google Music video, make sure you, if you're photosensitive, be careful for the very end, yeah. They should have put a sting in the beginning of it. Oh, this is a banger! What? 
I might just have to stand. What? That's funny, it's one of them. <laughs> That's funny. Well, okay, okay, go off, I guess. What? Okay, initial thoughts. Um, that one part that everyone and all the K-Nets were like, disgusting. They, they, that literally was like, maybe a 15 second part in the bridge. Like, <laughs> K-Nets deserve an award for overreacting because they were not happy with that part, but it's a 15 second part of, of, of a 3 minute and 40 second song. Like, literally, that was all like the negative things I heard about that was just centered on that one fifteen second part and I see I saw it in the comments of a post about it someone did say we just watch, watch the whole video and then you'll, you'll realize how enjoyable the song is and I realized that that's so true this was so enjoyable I was not expecting to enjoy this as much as I enjoyed their debut but I like this might I or dare I say even more than their debut um this reminds me, the, the concept of this kind of reminds me of if AOA were to be like 13 or 15, 13 to 15 years old and to have made like a cat in this era of K-pop, that's pretty much what it reminds me of. Like if you know the legendary song and if you know AOA and if you know that concept, you understand I'm getting that. And if you didn't know that, you also have, um, you also have very, um, What's the word? You have immaculate taste if you know what I'm talking about. And if you know what I'm trying to get at, immaculate. Your taste is quality, period. Okay, so now I'm gonna go. I'm gonna try and find out who that rapper is with the hair hair down. Because, ooh, girl, girl. The girl that I noticed might have been Nana Kim Na or <laughs> Kwon Nayeon. Uh, leader, leader, lead vocalist, lead rapper, main dancer, visual. I would not be surprised if that was the one I noticed because as I said before, I have a thing for leaders, I have a thing for rappers, and I have a thing for dancers. And she is all of that. Literally, she is all of that. Um, okay, yeah. I thought they were a six-member group, but one of the members left. Um, let's see. Yeah, I think the member I did notice was Nana. I think. If there's, I wouldn't be surprised if there's lyrics already, but I also want to know if, if I like for sure... That's why I noticed. I wouldn't be surprised if there's lyrics already, but at the same time, they're underrated. So, oh, just kidding. There's, oh, cause the showcase stage came out already. Oh my God, Lucy reminds me of um, G Wu card. <laughs> it was no wait. No, I think it was Nana. It was Nana. Yeah. So, my it's right there. <laughs> Um, song-wise, I, as I said, I like this more than I like the debut, which I was not expecting. I think, um, if you were like me and you saw, like, the kind of the negative reviews on that one 15 second part, <laughs> notice how my face just dropped. Um, k really need to stop it with the judging things so quickly. Um, yeah, I think that if you were, were someone that saw the negative reviews and you're kind of not very willing to watch this kind of this this music video i suggest that you go and watch it because it's it's quite good it does give me like the music video itself gives me stacy vibes even though this group has been around a bit longer than stacy has so the, the comparison can't really be made in that manner um it gives me the vibes that gives me the same aesthetic the same neon aesthetic kind of the same vibe that a lot of girl groups have going on these days with black mamba's aesthetic except i feel like black mamba's a little bit more fantasy-esque and it's staging and stuff like that uh, and the cinematography as well uh, while this is more e-girl uh, more gamer girl aesthetic um it's still cool still really neat and i really like the mix of like vocals and like rap i really like their rap um i like i like their rap more than their vocals i think um so i might give it like a 12 out of 10 this was really enjoyable it was really good i liked it a lot in terms of dance i was pleasantly surprised because i thought that that um 15 second part of the bridge that dance i thought it would be more like prevalent prevalent throughout the music video which i which is why i wasn't looking forward to it that much because that dance kind of like is interesting to me i don't know how much i enjoy it i'm glad it was only for 15 seconds i mean it was okay obviously the professionals they're very good um i think they're actually known for their dancing before they debuted which is sick um kind of kind of in a similar manner like how sf9 was known for their dancing before their debut because they were a dance uh, a dance career known as Neos, I think, like N E O Z. I think I forget if that was their name, but yeah, I think uh, Lula was known for their dancing before they before uh, like pre debut. 
so honestly my expectations were pretty high for them and they like so they like admit it so a hey, um i really liked the dance um and i was pleasantly surprised as i said before um so i'm gonna give it i'm gonna also give it or i'm gonna give it like an 11 out of 10 i enjoy the dance a little bit less than i enjoy their the dance for their debut actually but it was still good um they still killed it uh it was really good so hey 11 out of 10 final thoughts um i'm glad i'm walking away from this with a bias because i honestly am not the biggest fan of like casually listening to a group like there's very there's very few groups that i listen to that i just casually stand because i don't know for whatever reason it just like that confuses me when i just casually stand a group or casually listen to a group i'd much rather have a specific person to be like in to be like interested in rather than just to be like meh about it um so yeah i'm glad i'm walking away with from this uh, video with a bias now um I'm laughing at the fact that it's another leader, like, we've been new about how I always bias leaders. Um, these, this group I feel like has a lot, has a lot of potential. Um, in terms of the spectrum of current girl groups, I feel like, like, I, I'm not in a place to be speaking about this because I'm very unskilled, oh, I'm crying, but I do feel like if you look at um, groups like Stacy or groups like Espo with similar aesthetics, very similar concepts, I do feel like um i'm kind of scared because uh oversaturation of the same concept kind of leaves a lot of room for groups to kind of fall under the radar or to just um kind of be compared in like a negative way like how it already happened you knets can fight me i feel like hopefully this, this doesn't happen to this group because they have a lot of potential and yeah i i like i like them i like them they're really sick um yeah i really like this song Okay, if you guys want to talk about anything that I discuss in this video, such as um, just the group, such as your bias, your bias record, the song itself, or the dance, feel free to comment down below, and I will reply to you, and hopefully other people will reply, and we'll get a nice conversation going. Also, uh, if you have anything for me to react to in particular, feel free to drop it down below, or just if you have any requests for any other videos, just drop it down below as well, and I will maybe do your request. Um, and as I always say, if you like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Because by doing any of those three things, or by doing all of those three things, you really help me out as a content creator. And yeah, just as someone that enjoys making these sorts of videos, it really means a lot to see your guys' support. And as a reminder, I did open up a coffee page. The link to the page will be in the description down below, as always. And um, it's just a way for you to be able to keep up with... Um, my activities so yeah i just think it's a really cute way for you to be able to communicate with me and for me to communicate with you guys and yeah it's, i just really like it it's really easy to use and really efficient so yeah okay thank you guys so much for watching and stan Ua, and stream bad girl a bye guys